What's going on guys? It's Tony from Lomo Paintball and today we are talking the top five best paintball elbow pads of 2024. And why? Because who knows the bows that blows the bows? Everybody knows the source that blows the paintball goes! That would be LomoPaintball.com, the source for all the best elbows. Let's do it. All right, so top five today we've got the Exalt Freeflex, we've got the Carbon SC Pros, we've got the Die Core elbow pads, We've got the HK Army CTX, and we've got the infamous Gen 2, baby. Infamous Gen 2. All right, we're gonna start down here and keep it moving just like the rest of these bad boys. All right, top five, Exalt Free Flex. Um, <laughs> I'm just looking around real quick. I wonder if all these are gonna have the nice padded half hands like the Free Flex does. Uh, price range, any of these uh, elbow pads anywhere from, I think 55 to 65 bucks. So you're in a good price range there. Obviously very important to keep your forearm and elbow from getting busted from a bad dive on the ground. Uh, these ones are pretty lightweight, nice um, uh, breathability throughout here. Nice like a moisture wicking style hexagon pattern material. Like I said, it does have that padded half hand. So when you guys actually slide these bad boys on, it's got padding there. And then you've got the thumb loop in the back. So these things aren't gonna be falling down on you. You've got the nice elastic band to keep it tight around the um, your, the crevice of the elbow, once again, so it doesn't slide down. And then up top, where it's actually gonna be on your arm portion, you've got the kind of like that silicone tacking on the inside, so it's not sliding down your arm. And uh, obviously you're feeling uncomfortable, uh, whether you're wearing a jersey or not, most people obviously are gonna be wearing these underneath a paintball jersey. So you definitely don't want that, trying to fight through the jersey to get them pulled back up correctly. So. Exalt Free Flex, a huge seller for us. Actual tons and tons of padding where your elbow is going to be making contact with the ground. And they're actually still pretty flexible so you don't feel like you're a you know, stiff robot out there. So check these bad boys right on out. We've got full videos on all of these already on the YouTube channel. So if you want more in depth, go check them out. SC Pro by Carbon. Carbon, a lot of their uh, soft good products do come with the wash bag. So one of Mark's favorite part. So it's extremely important um, to keep your stuff safe in the washing machine so it's not getting beat up by the agitator. So these come with, obviously, you can wash them, take the sticker off here, and peel that sticker right on off. And then obviously don't leave that in there if you're gonna use the wash bag they provided you with. These ones, uh, we're talking going from really, really kind of hefty coverage, still flexible, but now we're talking very, very lightweight. Is there one inside of the other? That's how minimalistic these things are? Or is there just one still in the bag? I'm so confused here. There's one still in the bag. You still yeah. laughed when you I was there. like, did they really shove <laughs> an elbow pad in an elbow pad? So these ones, um, not gonna take up too much room in your gear bag. Very, very breathable material. It, this one also does have the nice little the nice little half hand there so you can sneak your thumb through so it doesn't be uh, moving around on you too much. Yes, there is padding here, but it's uh, very, very lightweight. Just enough to get the job done. Let's see if we can't roll these suckers on up. I mean, yeah, you could make a nice little nice little hamburger out of that, Mark. Uh, keeping, you know, not taking too much room up in the gear bag, but also leaving you a lot of room for mobility out there on the field. Um, very important for those the, the smaller, faster guys and the dudes that are trying to be real quick with their snap shooting because there's not, there's not too much going on here, just enough to get the job done. Nice little padded back there, like I said, where the elbow's gonna hit the ground. And then yes, of course, you've got the nice silicone tacking on the upper arm, so they're not gonna slide down on you when you got your jersey on, but it's carbon, very, very lightweight. Check them out, SC Pro elbow pads. If you're looking for something small and minimalistic, that would be a great choice. On to the die, die uh, core elbow pads here. So we're gonna take a look at these real quick, pull one of these out. Um, these ones are definitely gonna be a little bit uh, more chunky than the carbon one, I can tell you that much. Let me just slide this on out. Should have done that beforehand, but you guys can bear with me, join the show. So you got the die core elbow pad. This one's got padding, I mean, all the way up from the top of the arm, very nice thick padding, and then down throughout the elbow here. You've got a cinch strap right around the wrist. So if you guys wanna keep these really from not moving on you whatsoever, cinch that up with the elastic band as tight as you want. And then of course, a nice padded half hand near the bottom. So die, uh, nowhere near as um, like flexible per se as the carbons, but tons more protection. If you guys are one of those out there that really don't like the, the sting of a paintball, these, these ones might be for you. Or if you're one of those guys that constantly dive at every point or every scenario event, 
These ones also might be for you. Nice mesh breathability here in the back where it's actually gonna get real nice and sweaty. So allow some, um, some room for breathability and moisture wicking. And I think, uh, yeah, overall, I mean, they're not terrible. They're not the most flexy elbow pad out there, but they're, it's an elbow pad for a reason. It wants to keep you protected. So check these ones out. Yeah, it wouldn't be a bad move. Die makes some great products. So um, what about the kind of guys that dive in the staging area? Would this work for them too? <laughs> yes, it will, 100%. Yeah, if you're diving in the staging area, you're definitely gonna want these, keep you fully protected all the way from the top of the arm, throughout the elbow and your forearm. So those are the die core elbow pads. We're gonna move on to the HK Army. This is not a wash bag, but the CTX. Got the HK Army CTX. This one's a really nice one. It's, it's kind of um, in the middle of being super protective and hunky to super minimalistic. This one's kind of in the middle. Still plenty of padding, but you can, you can get some real good flexibility out of this one too. So I think HK did a, honestly a really good job with this elbow pad. So you're not super bulky, but you're not too thin and HK, cool, kings of cool, you got the nice silicone down here with the half hand. It is not padded, but uh, this is the, so it can pretty much stick to your jersey and not go anywhere. You could probably see how shiny that is on the camera mark, I'm assuming. Shiny. Maybe. Shiny, shiny. Plenty of protection from the top of the arm all the way throughout the, uh, the forearm and the elbow here. So very, very nice. Let's see what it's got. Of course, it's got the, that uh, mesh breathability here. So when you guys are nice, Hot and sweaty, been playing paintball for hours. You've got all that ventilation in here to at least help release some of that steam and heat and uh, keep you out there on the field longer. And then of course, natural, oh no, it, it, I felt like it did, but it didn't. It doesn't have, doesn't have the silicone tacking up top like some of the other ones do. Just elastic. No, yeah, just elastic up there. It doesn't have the tacking, but um, either way, I like that half hand because you actually get this sucker on, you know, and it's locked into your thumb region. That works for uh, stability as well. So HKCTX elbow pads coming in strong, kind of near the middle of not being too fat, not being too minimalistic. Boom. All right, last one. We are on to the infamous Gen 2s. Let's see if I can't get it off this giant piece of cardboard here. Infamous Gen 2s, uh, this one reminds me of the carbon a little bit, but has more padding. Super minimalistic, easy to fold up, not take up too much room in the gear bag, but it does definitely have more padding from actually the elbow region down into the forearm region as well. So you've got starting up here and all the way down, and then you do have, hmm, I think every single one of these had a half hand on it. So I think that's the new kind of the new trend we're following. Every elbow pad here had the half hand where your thumb goes through and uh, really, really lightweight. It's all got that four way stretch material on here and where you're actually the crease of the elbow is, you can see the difference. It's got that uh, vented mesh so you guys can keep that heat out and you know, it can get a little, little soggy in there sometimes if you're in the elbow pads for hours. So um, Infamous doing a really good job with these keeping it lightweight, but also making sure keeping you fully protected out there on the field. All of these elbow pads are great choices, guys. Uh, if you guys wanna do any more in depth on them, I mean, an elbow pad's an elbow pad, but check them out on the YouTube channel already. They're out. Top five of 2024, check them out, shop them now. It's almostpaintball.com. You know, I wear elbow pads with half hands and then I put on my jersey that has half hands and then I put gloves over top of that. So then my protected. knuckles don't feel nothing. You're protected, fully protected. protected. Get protected here at the best, Lomo Paintball. Psst, .com. See you.